house. Listen, Huddersfield in town today, are they going to be scared of pulling the Mighty Mighty Bees, yeah? Yeah! So listen, what do you reckon today? Score prediction. 3-1 to the Bees. 3-1. 4-0. Good game today, Huddersfield town are in place and they're a bit nervous coming against the mighty bees and so rightly so isn't they it should be. Too they, should they should be scared we are on fire Two, i reckon there's i think it's going to be a good game i think there is going to be goals conceded both yeah. sides yotta so, um, is on fire at the minute we're, we're wanting the goals and we're wanting to get higher up the league so i'm going to go three one then bring it on definitely going to smash one confident then yes yes come great. on you bees come on you bees Huddersfield today, two, two informed teams. What are you expecting from today, Butch? A good game of football. Uh, two football insides, nice conditions for it. Uh, a good, fast paced game. A goal or two. Uh, we'll probably concede a goal or two, as is our want. Um, they'll come to play. It should be a really, really good game of football. I've seen us get spanked here before, but I'm feeling quite confident today. Listen, the Wagner man, you know, he's got his own beer, from what we've heard, and also he's got a new team this season. They're doing all right, though, aren't they? Yeah, it's a good season for us. Having a good time. Loving it. Huddersfield Town not being the underdogs. It's unbelievable. So, score prediction? Tight. 2 1 to the town. Coming out, you've had a wicked season so far, haven't you? We have, yeah. Toe. We've done really well so far. Tough game today though, Brentford on a good run. I believe you've got 10 points out of a possible 12 if you last four games, so it's going to be a tough match. Uh, no Aaron Moyes on the bench today. You see Brown, he's been in great form. He's also on the bench, so going to be tricky. Going to be a tricky match. It's going to be tricky, but I'm going to ask you to give us a score prediction. <laughs> I'm going to say we've only won once this season by more than one goal. I'm going to say it's going to be 2-1 to the Terriers. Come on, you me! Come on, you Terriers. <laughs> They play better than us, don't they? Basically, they're a better side. I can't really grumble. I think we might nick it who cries the second half, but they look far better, far better side. Especially on the left hand side here. I don't know what his name is, the big fella. He's, he's miles better than anything we've got, unfortunately. He's coming, Jota's kind of marking him, and he's, that's not really working, is it? <laughs> it's not working. It's not hot, because it's normally, I think he'd be able to cope out there, but this fella, he's, he is a league above. And uh, yeah, fair enough, fair enough. I think a few of us were expecting us to kind of show Huddersfield how good we were, but it's That's been, what I thought it's been the other way around exactly. so far. No, I thought, well, I thought it was going to be lots of goals for a start. Well, I mean, it's still early, I know it's only half time, but I thought it was going to be more goals. And I thought, yeah, I thought we'd be more on fire. From our past performances recently, I thought we could have a lot more to show and have a lot, you know, we're at home, make a real game of it, but it's not happened so far. Hopeful? Always, <laughs> always. How are you been? Second half, 2-1. It's been an even game so far. We, we had it in the first 10 minutes, but we let them back through. We're still losing out to the long ball on the flanks. We need to cover that, and we need to also have height in the defence. But still, no, no it's lost. You know, Brent Rahal are playing their game as well. You know, we had chances. The referee's not helping with some decisions, but we're there. So, you know. So second half, what do you reckon? Second half, if we can up our game a little bit more, Counteract their, uh, you know, uh, hitting us on the flanks and everything like that. Um, I'm sure we can uh, we can get the goals we need because uh, Joe nearly got one in the first half. New bees, come on, new bees.
Lucille, that was a tough, tough afternoon. Yeah. They deserved it, didn't they? Yeah, they were the better team. Uh, I don't think they were. Very, I don't think the Red Bull were very good. We didn't create many chances, and we just we played the same way we did in the first half. Do you, we we did? Looked, do you think we looked a bit tired today? Yeah, I think in the second half we looked worn out. Players like Hotter and Lasse Vive weren't going for the ball, so you know, at the end of the day. A bit disappointed or? A bit disappointed, but it's kind of what we expected. So I think Huddersfield are a good team and they might go up. You reckon they might go up? They might, they might. So we're going to bounce back. We've got Wolverhampton Wanderers on yeah. Tuesday. Well, I'm hoping we win that, seeing as Wolves are in the relegation zone, but you never know with Red Bull. Come on, you boys. Come on, you boys. Lost 1 0 to Huddersfield. What did you make of the game? They're bigger, stronger, faster than we were. Um, it's the reason why they're third, I guess. Uh, we were out muscled. Um, we could have sneaked a goal, uh, which may have just about have been fair, just about, but that's why they're up where they're up where they are, I guess. You impressed by them? Yeah, they were, they were just big, strong. Uh, you know, they, they'll lose in the playoffs. Um, I, I wouldn't be surprised until they get to Wembley and lose because uh, I don't think they're good enough to go up. But did you expect more from Brentford today? I did, but we've had a lot of games. Uh, we've had a lot of games. And we don't have much on the bench. Uh, you know, you look at it, and you know, you've got Kirsch. Hoffman, we haven't got much depth at the moment, so not much for us to not not much for us to draw. You must be delighted. You come here, you needed a win, you wanted a win. Yeah, another three points, mate. Top of the league nearly. Just gotta see uh, Brighton slip up now. And then uh, we'll be done for that second spot. So spirit. Newcastle, they lost. Newcastle got beat. You yeah, must be you must Reading be. got beat as well, so uh, so I understand. So, so yeah. that's a good day for you. Here, did you you look like you had a game plan, keep it very tight, you've won another game one nil. I think it just does the same thing every time. It, it, doesn't worry teams. The teams are worried about us coming to see them these days. Uh, it's great to be supporting them at this time. It's fantastic. I wouldn't go, I mean, if I said you did a job on us today, that sounds like you no, came no, no, and spoiled. You, were, you, like you, you did it. You yeah. played no, you, at the beginning, we were a bit uh, a bit loose and you did it. You did all right, but we got back into the game. We managed to get the goal. I think it was a bit lucky. I couldn't see it. It was the wrong end of the pitch, but uh, it's a good three. Yeah, I've got to see the replay, but it's three points and uh, you know, you know there's a lot of pressure right now. The, getting the fixtures out of the way now, isn't it? Uh, really, really, Newcastle lost, Reading lost, I've just looked, it's, uh, you know, so you never know, you never know, we might not have to do the dreaded playoffs. <laughs> there was a song on the Elian Road today that said you're going to cry on the telly, um, predicting you're going to lose at Wembley. Well, maybe so, but you know what, we never expected to be here, we expected mid-table or top half, and look where we are.